All right, so we're about to unbox our solar panels here to create the front array of the bus. We're doing three panels and three panels, and our solar rails are a little bit too long. So we kind of just need to figure out how much we need to cut them, what's the spacing like. So we're gonna go ahead and do the testing here on the floor, because we're not about to bring hundreds of pounds of weight onto the roof and not know what we're doing. So we originally bought these L brackets to mount our solar rails to the roof, but as you can see, they are at a perfect 90 degree and our roof is curved. So we went ahead and got some aluminum flat stock, flat stock, cut some up into six inches so we can fabricate our own. These are super strong. This just can't be bent without snapping. So we take one of these, we put it into the vise and then we slowly bend it down. We're going to use this first one as a template. So we want all of our brackets to match this profile. And once we've got all of these set up, we're gonna do two holes in the base, which are gonna go into the ribs of the bus, and one hole on the upright, which will then attach to the track here on the rail. And then ultimately the panels get uh, mounted down through this top channel on there as well. Sounds good, let's get started. This top piece is kind of all curved now. Yeah, we yeah. Want a little bit of a tighter radius. And then we will flip this piece around. It. Oh, because it gets straight. Ends. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, you guys. Hey. 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 We're recording. Going on yeah, this is how we do it. Yeah, this is live. <laughs> So we're using the 3M Marine Adhesive Sealant 5200. So this is both gonna act as a sealant where we're putting in these self-tapping screws and it will become part of the bond between the bracket and the roof. There is a bolt in my roof. Thanks, Renegy, for sponsoring this video. Oh, Lord. Are you shifting gears? Yeah. <laughs>
So this is what we call the she ain't going anywhere test. Once you've secured something on a roof, you grab on nice and hard and you give it a shake and you say, she ain't going anywhere. We just received our final two solar panels from Renogy and we're gonna go ahead and install them up on the roof with the other four we already have fully installed. And then our solar array will be complete. Even at the last stage, there's always something happening. Look at our panels! Whee! With this project coming to a close, let's recap everything that we did. We started by manufacturing the brackets, we installed the solar rails, and then we mounted all six of our solar panels. In total, our system has six 550 watt solar panels totaling an array of 3,300 solar watts, which is a massive system. We want to give a huge thank you to Renogy for not only supplying us these six amazing solar panels that are going to allow us to be fully off grid, but also sponsoring our batteries, which we're going to be installing in a video soon. As always, thank you so much for watching our videos. Stay tuned for more Jess and Jake. Ah. Ah.